Hey guys, we just wanted to tell you about our new merch. What? We have new merch? Are you serious? Yeah, and it's so cuddly and adorable. Wait a minute. Do we have unicorns? <laughs> Daisy, of course we don't have unicorns. But we do have snugglers. What? They're adorable. Snugglers are your adorable, squeezy, cuddly friend. I want them, Molly. They're so cute. We also have backpacks and t-shirts. You guys can check it out by going to starsquad.shop. Now it's time to get to the video. Come on, Molly. We're going to be late. What are you waiting for? I don't want to go to school today. Well, what's new? But this is preschool. It's not like you're going to get detention or homework. No, I know. I just I don't want to go. If we're late, though, you might get a timeout. I don't want to go, okay? Sometimes I just I want to stay home, okay? Molly, that's ridiculous. You know we have to go here so that mom can work and we can learn lots of good things. Just, I don't feel very good today. Don't try to fake being sick. Everybody know it's not true. Now come on, before we're late, I want to see all of our friends. Fine, but I'm telling you, my stomach kind of hurts. Oh, why can't I get in? Hello? Let us in! Molly, come on, let's just go in through the baby entrance. I'm not a baby anymore. Ugh, my stomach really hurts. Yeah, yeah, Molly, you're faking it. Everybody knows it. I I'm not faking it. I, I really don't feel good. Well, why don't you go to the bathroom and try to go poo-poo? That might make you feel better. I don't have to go poo-poo. Ugh, my sister is so annoying. Just leave me alone, okay? You don't have to believe me. No one asked you to anyway. Oh, no. My stomach is really starting to hurt. Oh, man. I think I do actually have to go potty. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I hope I make it in time. Oh, that's so embarrassing to have an accident. Wait a minute, I'm going the wrong way. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, I'm not going to make it to the potty! <laughs> Too late. Uh-oh. Oh no! I went poo-poo in my pants! Oh! That's so embarrassing! Well, good morning, Molly. Ew, what's that smell? Uh-oh, did you have an accident? I didn't mean to, I promise, I didn't! <laughs> I, I, I didn't mean to! It's okay, Molly, it's okay. We'll just, we'll just change your pull-up and everything will be fine, I promise. Oh, how embarrassing! It's alright, trust me. Everybody has accidents when they're toddlers. I don't really feel good today. My stomach is really hurting. Oh, that's probably just because you're hungry. It is snack time. Come on, we'll get something to eat. No, oh, I'm telling you, I don't want anything to eat. It sounds really gross. No, you're probably just hungry. Did you know that if you get too hungry, your tummy can actually hurt? Now play with your toy and be good. Now, come on, let's eat up. I'm telling you, I don't feel so good. And I don't want to eat that baby food. Ah, oh, la, la, da, da, da. Da 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 Molly says she doesn't feel good, but she's a liar. I'm not lying. Oh. Ew! Oh, yuck! You throw up on me! Oh, yuck! They don't pay me enough for this job to have babies throw up on me! Oh, I'm sorry, Taylor. I didn't mean it. Sorry, I didn't mean to freak out. It's just, ew, throw up makes me really grossed out. Whoa, Molly, are you okay? I'm not sure. I don't feel so. <clears throat> Ew, now she threw up on me. Ew, she really is sick. Oh my, it looks like we're going to need to give you a bath, Molly. You're covered in throw up. I don't feel so good. <laughs> I just want my mommy. <clears throat> it's okay, we're going to take you... Take very good care of you here, Molly, until your mom can come pick you up. Well, good luck. Our mom's at a business meeting today. She probably won't be able to pick us up for hours. Don't say that, Daisy. I want my mom. <laughs> oh, no. Are you going to throw up again? Don't throw up in the tub. Or on me. Oh, yuck. Oh, no. I feel a little better, though, after I threw up so many times. 
I think you better take a nap, Molly. You're definitely sick with something. Maybe food poisoning or the stomach bug? Can I have something to drink? I feel so thirsty after throwing up so much. Of course you can, sweetie, but I think we should just give you some water and not milk, because milk can make your stomach upset when it already is hurting. I just want my mommy! <laughs> Molly, I promise I'm going to take good care of you. Okay. I guess I believe you. <laughs> I just don't feel good. I know, honey. It's going to be okay. La da da, la da da, la da da da, da da da. It's going to be okay, Molly. I think when you take a nap, you'll feel better when you wake up. I sure hope so. I don't want to throw up anymore. Mm, it seems like you may have gotten it out of your system, sweetie. Now take a nice night night and everything will be okay, I promise. Okay, just just don't swing me around too much because I think I might throw up again. Daisy, what's wrong? I don't feel so good. My stomach hurts. Oh, don't fake it, Daisy. Marley, I'm not faking it. When have I ever ugh, faked anything? You're still faking it. I don't believe that was a real throw up. Marley, I just ugh, threw up twice. What are you talking about? I can't fake that. You probably gave me a stomach bug. What? No, I didn't. I wouldn't do that. Oh my gosh, what's... Ew, gross, another baby threw up. Oh no, it's the dreaded stomach bug. Dun, dun, dun. We'll all have it. I just know it. Every single parent, caregiver, and child at Twilight Daycare will get this. I don't feel so good. Ugh. Don't worry, Daisy. It only lasts a couple of hours, then it goes away. I'm feeling lots better. I can't believe you gave me a stomach bug. Oh, this is the worst. This is seriously the worst. Uh, hopefully nobody else is throwing up. Is everybody okay? No one's answering. Okay, um, I want to slime somebody right now and tell them that they that I have the stomach bug. Um, uh, let's see, who should I do? Eeny, meeny, miny, mo, catch a tiger by its toe. If he hollers, let him go. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. You're about, oh, I can slime everybody. How much does that cost? 50 Robux, worth it. <laughs> okay, when's everybody gonna get slimed? When you all get, wait, how did you pick me up? I don't want you to pick me up. Stop picking me up. Okay, I paid for everybody to get slimed. And, um, nobody got slimed. Molly, what exactly are you doing right now? I'm, um, oh, whoa. 400 Robux? No, no, no. I'm uh, nothing. I'm, I'm not doing anything. Uh, yeah, no, not, not at all. Molly, are you back to your old antics of being a prankster? Me? No, not at all. Molly, you just dumped slime on my head. Molly! Oh my gosh, you need to go to timeout. You can't give me timeout today. What? Why not? Because I was so sick with the stomach bug. Well, now you seem just fine. So now it's time for timeout. What? Don't you dare take me to baby jail. Don't you dare. Um, baby jail is exactly where you belong. Let me out. This is rude. This can't be happening. Let me out of jail. I don't like this. I want to go home. I want my mommy. I'm warning you, Taylor. You're not going to like what happens next. I want to get out of here. Let me out of timeout. This isn't fair. And how did that work out for you, Molly? You're still not going to let me out? This is rude. Ah, I want to get out of here. Let me out. Ah! Molly, you can have more temper tantrums if you like, but then you're going to be in timeout even longer. You're so rude! Why is this happening to me? Ma! I'm not a bad kid and just because I pranked you and it was kind of funny. Molly, you're going to stay there so you can calm down. I'm never going to calm down! Do I look calm to you? Ma! This is making me so mad! <sighs> <sighs> okay. I think I'm done having a temper tantrum now. <sighs> okay, Molly. If you think you're done being a prankster and having your temper tantrums, you can come out and rejoin society. Okay, fine. I'll be good. I promise. Sort of. 
Watch this, guys. This is gonna be awesome. Purchased. <laughs> Where'd she go? I wanna see this. Who just slimed me? Molly, was that you? M Molly, come back here. Not a chance, lady. I'm out of here. <laughs> Caught you. Back to timeout for you. No, I want to escape, please. Oh, okay, wait. I, I can't escape. It cost me 50 Robux and I'm poor. Let me, let me out of here. No! Okay, I can break the toilet. <laughs> oh my gosh, guys. I just found out how you escape. Oh my gosh. Guys, I just found an underground maze. What? Underneath Twilight Daycare. Are you kidding me right now? Where's this go? This is insane. Oh! <laughs> oh my gosh! I just escaped Twilight Daycare on Baby Jail. And guys, I'm just going to spend the rest of the day at the beach chilling without any rolls. This is amazing. I'm having the best day ever. I mean, after I got done having a stomach bug and stuff. Whoa! Look at that rubber ducky! Good thing I just learned how to swim. Rubber ducky, you're so cute! Ooh, and a unicorn? Yes, please! This sounds like my kind of day. <laughs> I'm so thirsty. Molly, we just had breakfast five minutes ago. I know, but I need some milk. I need some milk! Uh, you're so lucky. I wish I could drink some milk. What? Why? Excuse me, we're trying to have a conversation. Rude! Molly, don't say that. They'll put you in time out. So, Daisy, why can't you drink any milk? My tummy just feels kind of funny today. Uh, it's even sticking out farther than it normally does. You know what that means? It means you gotta fart. <laughs> Repeat after me. <laughs> Ew, Molly, you probably went doo-doo in your diaper. Good morning, girls. Who's ready to ride the ponies? Oh, Molly, you look so sad. What's wrong? I have to tinkle. I have to go potty. Okay, come with me. And then we're gonna go ride the ponies. Aren't you excited? Yeah, I I'm pretty excited. I'm really thirsty, though. Okay, go ahead, sit on the potty. Can I have a drink? I need some milk. Hello? Hello? Uh-oh, she left. I can't believe she left me all alone on the potty. What if I fall in? What if I What if I go down to the sewer and I drown? Um, Molly, I think you're being a little dramatic. I'm right here, and you're just fine. Now go wash your hands, please. Okay, fine. I can't believe she left me there alone. Terrible caregiver! Molly... I think you're just a little grumpy. Maybe you need a snack before we ride the ponies? Yeah, I need a snack. Of course I do. You always get so hangry. Um, is Daisy gonna have a snack too? I don't buy a snack. I don't feel good. Oh, Daisy, your stomach still hurts? Well, maybe you're just hungry, sweetheart. Why don't we try feeding you something? All right, Molly, let's just put you in your high chair and give you a snack and a drink, and then we'll go ride the ponies. Okay, mmm, rice, mmm, this is delicious. Daisy, are you sure you don't want any? No, my stomach hurts so bad. I think there might be something wrong with me. Oh, honey, it's probably just, just like a little, a little tummy upset. You'll be okay. I'm feeling pretty good. I ate tons of rice and it was delicious, and then I had a bottle of milk. Ah, my tummy is so happy. My tummy feels awful. Well, maybe once you ride the ponies, you'll feel better, Daisy. Come on, let's go. Oh, look it. I think that pony really likes me. Hi, I'm Molly. Molly, horses don't speak English. Oh, well, maybe they speak horse. Nay, nay, nay. Well, you can't speak horse. Yes, I can. Oh, here comes a unicorn. Or Pegasus. I think it's a Pegasus because it's got wings. I want to ride the Pegasus. Okay, the Pegasus obviously wants me to ride it, but I don't, I don't know how to get on its back. I'm too little. Teacher, help me. There you go, Molly. You just needed a little bit of help. Yeah. <laughs> this is fun. Whee! Um, and also, that's not a Pegasus. That's a flying unicorn. A flying unicorn? Whoa. 
The wings are beautiful. Um, can you stop going so fast, though? You're making my tummy hurt. Tell me about it. My tummy's been hurting all day. Okay, girls. Well, since your tummies are both hurting, maybe it's time to go for a nap. Or maybe it's time to go to the hospital. Aww. I don't feel right. I want to see a doctor right now. Oh, Daisy, it's really that bad? Yeah, she's been telling you. Uh-oh. Oh, my gosh. She just threw up everywhere. All over that girl. Oh, no. I don't feel good. Ew, you threw up on me. Gross. Does anyone have any paper towels? Um, no, but you could go to get some at the nurse's station. Oh, Daisy, this is making me so sad that you're so sick. Girls, we need to take Daisy to the hospital and quick. Daisy, everything's going to be okay, I promise. Molly, my stomach, it hurts so, so bad. Oh, no, Daisy, I'm so sorry this is happening to you. You're the most annoying sister in the world, but I hate to see you sick. I know, it's just so awful. <laughs> Well, the doctor's going to know what to do. I know it. They're going to make you all better. May I have your attention, please? The next patient is Daisy. I need to go potty. I'm going to throw up. Oh, uh, you better hurry up. She, she needs a wheelchair. Somebody help. I don't need a wheelchair. I have to go to the bathroom. And also, I think I'm going to throw up again. Not on me. Oh, my gosh. I don't want to get thrown up on yuck. Do you have a bucket, Molly? Oh, my stomach. Hi there, I'm Dr. Smith, and I'd be happy to help your sister. Well, you better hurry, because she's about to go poo-poo in her pants, and she's throwing up. Oh, my. Okay, sweetheart, just get right into the wheelchair, and I'll take you into the exam room. And are you okay, little girl? My name's Molly, and yeah, I'm just really tired. Having a sister that's sick is exhausting. Right this way, sweetheart. Everything's going to be a-okay. I hope so. I, I really need a drink. I want some milk. And I want my mommy. I want my mommy too. Well, your mommy's at work, but don't worry. She's been called. She'll be here as soon as possible. Now, I just need you to lay down in this bed so we can do a checkup and see if there's something wrong with your tummy. Okay, Daisy, let's take a look at your tummy. First, I'm going to put a little bit of pressure on your tummy and I'm going to feel for any bumps or lumps. I'm feeling very sick. When I turn you or twist you this way, does your tummy hurt? Yes, it hurts so bad. All right, we're going to need to get an x-ray of your stomach and maybe an ultrasound too. Oh my gosh, is that going to hurt? No, neither one of those hurt at all. Now, come on, Daisy. Oh my gosh, I'm so worried about my sister. Oh man. I also have to go to the bathroom. I'm really thirsty and I need a nap. Worst day ever! <laughs> What's happening, doctor? What did you find out? Well, we did the x-ray and your sister has to have her appendix out. Wait, what? I want to have surgery! <laughs> Don't worry, sweetie. You won't feel a thing because you'll be asleep. And when you wake up, you'll eat all the ice cream you can stand. Whoa, sounds pretty good to me, Daisy. Can I have surgery too? I'm gonna eat ice cream. I don't want it. <laughs> All right, sweetie. I'm just going to lay you on the operating table and give you some medicine that'll help you fall asleep. When you wake up, your mom will be here and everything will be all over and your tummy won't hurt anymore. Oh my gosh. I can't believe my sister's gonna have surgery at Twilight Daycare. Do they do surgery here? Yes, we have doctors on staff for such things. Now you have to wait in the waiting room, Molly. You can't be in the surgery room, of course. Of course. Oh my gosh, my poor sister. Will she be okay? Will she survive? Oh my gosh, I'm so worried about my sister. She's so annoying, but... Wait a minute. I'm worried about her, but I'm also feeling kind of hungry. Where's the snack bar? I totally need to go get a snack. Ooh, a snack bar. Full of donuts? Yes, please. Oh my gosh, I'm so hungry. All right, let's see how much everything costs. Ooh, two dollars. I probably can afford that, I think. Give me a donut! My sister's in the hospital, I need it! Oh, thank you very much. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That was delicious. Can I buy another one? 
Oh, I'm totally gonna eat all these donuts until I explode. Mm. May I have your attention, please? May I have your attention, please? Daisy has just finished surgery. Daisy has just finished surgery. Oh, wow. I can't stay here and eat all these donuts. I gotta go see my sister. Daisy? Daisy, are you okay? I feel kind of funny. My stomach doesn't really hurt anymore, though. I want my mommy! Oh, Daisy, Mom's gonna be here any minute. I just know it. How was the surgery? I don't know. I don't remember anything. All I know is they said, count to three. I went one, two. Now I woke up over here. I guess the surgery's over. Yeah, the surgery's over, Daisy. Now they said you could eat as much ice cream as you want. Well, that's good, because I'm very hungry if I'm not eating all day. Oh, I'm so glad you can eat again, and that your stomach doesn't hurt anymore. Yeah, except for they told me after the surgery I would have to fart a lot. Say what? Yeah, and I'm sort of feeling... Ew, Daisy! Gassy. <laughs> oh my gosh, that smells awful! Oh, it's making me want to... Ew, Molly! <laughs> Sorry, you stink so bad. Gross. Oh, you're so dramatic. I want my mom. I want my mom. Daisy already told you she's coming any minute. She's going to take you home, and then you're not going to be able to go to um, Twilight Daycare for at least probably a week because you had surgery. Yeah, but that's okay. I'll stay home and eat ice cream and watch all the TV I want while you have to come and do class and homework and stuff. Wait, what? I have to come even though you don't? That sounds completely unfair. Oh, it is, Molly. All you have to do is have surgery. I don't want surgery, but I don't want to come to school every day. Uh, Molly, that's just the way educational daycare is. And since you're not sick, you get to do all the homework. I don't like this. I don't like this at all! Ugh, no! Not my alarm! Too early! Too early! <sighs> Why hasn't somebody turned off that alarm yet? It's so annoying! Okay. Okay, I'm up. Ugh. This whole school thing is getting really old. Why do I need to get ready this early? I mean, can't school just happen, like, never again? <laughs> that would be perfect. Ugh. What should I wear today? No, no. Also, no. Also, no. Ooh, let's check in here. Um, ooh. Um, no, no. Also, no. Ooh, this is cute. Could wear that. And also, uh, this. Mm, perfect. My eyes even aren't even awake yet. <laughs> like, seriously, they're still closed because it's so early in the morning. Uh, Molly, why are you being so loud? Cheapers. I'm trying to sleep in. You sleep in on a school day? <coughs> Molly, it's not a school day. It's Sunday. Say what? It's it's Sunday? It's not a school day? Are you pranking me right now? No, Molly. When would I ever prank you about it being school or not school? I would be awake by now if it's school. Now go back to sleep. Or get out of our room because I'm tired. Oh, yeah. I'm going back to sleep. Till at least 10 or 11 o'clock. <laughs> Girls, rise and shine. Mom, we don't have school today. We're sleeping in. Uh, Molly, it's noon. I think you've already slept in. Ah, I love Sundays. They're like the best. Me too. Ugh. Sleeping in is perfect. <sighs> uh, Molly, did you sleep in your clothes? What are you wearing? She thought it was a school day, so she got up at 6 a.m. Oh, Molly. <laughs> Poor kid. Yeah, but I got to go back to bed, so it was totally fine. Girls, I made your favorite breakfast pizza. Yes, breakfast pizza. Last one downstairs is a rotten egg, Daisy. Molly, don't jump over the railing! Hey, Dad, what's up? Hey, Molly, um, I thought you were gonna sleep in forever. <laughs> the whole day is wasting. Nah, I think just sleeping in uh, is the best thing you could do with your day ever. Uh, I love being lazy. 
I know, Molly, I know. But maybe you could try to be a little less lazy about, you know, your schoolwork. Uh, yeah, sure, Dad, I'll try. Wow, Molly, this breakfast pizza is so good. Yeah. Mm. Mom always makes the best pizza in the world. When she makes a breakfast pizza, it makes my heart and my tummy so happy. I'm glad you like it, girls. So don't tell me. We have to do laundry. We have to wash the floors. We have to dust. We have to do homework. What? No, it's Sunday. Today's my day off. I'm not doing anything. Except for spending some time with my family, of course. Aww. How about in a little while we go down to the beach? The beach? That sounds great. But, Mom? Yes, Molly? Do you have any more of this breakfast pizza? I'm still hungry. Of course I do, Molly. I made two pizzas just for you. <laughs> Why can't every day be the weekend? Well, because then we'd miss school. Exactly. Okay, family, who's ready to have some fun? I am. I am too. I'm so ready to just like relax, maybe make some s'mores. Yeah, that sounds delicious. But for now, let's just listen to some great music. Honey, do we have to stop for gas? I'm so excited to get to the beach. Well, if you actually want to get to the beach, yes. We're going to run out. Uh, okay. Just seems like Sundays are just so short. Like, we barely have enough time to get there and relax. Don't worry, honey. We're going to have plenty of time. It's going to be a great day. Dad, are we there yet? No, Molly, not yet. Are we there yet now? No, Molly, we're still not there. How about now? How about now? How about now? Molly, you're super annoying. Stop it. Oh, uh, yeah, Molly, I agree with your sister. Please, stop it. But I want to know, are we there yet? Dad, are we there yet? Molly, we're not there yet. How about now? No, Molly. Okay, well, how about now? Yes, we're there. Woohoo! Now, this is a life just chilling at the beach. Yeah, I feel like I could write a song about this. Chilling at the beach, it's so much fun. Chilling at the beach, it's so much fun. Molly, no, just no. Yeah, you like my song. Say it. Say I like your song. No, Molly. Okay, I'm gonna keep singing it then. Chilling at the beach, it's so much fun. A chilling at the beach, beach, it's so much fun. Oh boy, I'm moving over there. Okay, so I have all the snacks, and who's ready for s'mores? Me! I'm ready! I'm ready! I'm ready! Dad, why are you wearing a lifeguard outfit? <laughs> I used to be a, a lifeguard when I was like 20, and I couldn't believe I still fit in this outfit. <laughs> That's awesome, right? Uh, yeah, sure, Dad, but you know, you can get a new bathing suit. You don't have to wear the same one for like 60 years. 60 years? What do you think, I'm 80 years old? Well, Dad, you are pretty old. Oh, I'm not 80 though, Molly. Come on, give me a little credit. Where is the s'mores? Mom, why are you being so lazy? Come on, get the stuff out for the s'mores. Do the mom stuff. Molly, I am on vacation. No, you're not. We're not on vacation. It's just Sunday and we're like 30 minutes from our house. Okay, we're well, on taking a day vacation. All the stuff that you need is over there in the cooler. Okay, I'll do it myself. Can't believe my mom's went on vacation. I know. Oh, man, it's like I have to do stuff for myself. Oh, she packed sandwiches, though. And Cokes. They're delicious. Daisy, you're going to burn your marshmallow. Do I not, Molly? Yes, you are, Daisy. You're going to burn it, and then you won't want to eat it. Molly, I like mine kind of crispy. Yeah, well, you're going to burn it. You're going to burn it. You're going to burn it. Molly, you're driving me crazy. I can't really have a day off now, can I, if my annoying sister is well annoying? <laughs> ah, did you eat it, Daisy? Yeah, it's delicious, too. And I didn't even burn it, so not that much. Mmm. These s'mores are delicious. Mmm. So good. I guess it's okay that I had to make it for myself. Uh, Molly, you're totally capable of making your own s'mores. Ah, this is great, Dan. Maybe we should plan a real vacation. Yeah, except for I have to work overtime. I'm sorry, honey. Well, at least we have our Sundays. Yeah. And they're perfect. If you don't count having the annoying sister coming along. Daisy! Stop being so rude. You stop being so annoying. Both of you stop fighting, please. 
Well, with the price of gas, we can't really afford to go anywhere anyway. I mean, <laughs> it cost us a thousand dollars just to drive an hour from here. Dad, you're being totally dramatic. No, I'm not. They raised the gas prices to ten ninety nine a gallon. Oh, well, makes no difference to me. I don't buy gas. Nobody, you just have gas. <laughs> <laughs> now that's very true. Ah, the water feels amazing. Ah, perfect day. Daisy, where'd you get that donut? You're making me hungry. Molly, it's not a real donut. It's an inner tube for the water. Molly, don't you dare try to bite it. You'll put a hole in it. Come here, that, that looks delicious. Come here. Molly, stop it. Wasn't that the perfect day, girls? It really was. I agree. Now we can watch a family movie and it'll be just like the most perfect day. Yeah, let's watch Encanto. Oh, we have to watch that movie again? Just kidding. I love that movie. Me too, <laughs> especially the songs. Under pressure. Dad, that's not how the song goes at all. That was just weird. <laughs> Oopsie. Mm, leftover pizza. Don't you want to eat some popcorn, Molly? No? Okay, well, more for me, hooray! <laughs> Dad, you're so funny. Daisy, I'm so glad that this is our first day of daycare. Look at all these toys we can play with. Yeah, everyone seems so nice, Molly. I really like it here. Me too. Oh, it's, it's, whoa. Look at that toddler. It looks just, just like you. What? I have a doppelganger, a twin. Whoa. Yeah, um, maybe when you get older, you'll look just like that, Daisy. I bet I will, Molly, for sure. Let's play with something. I don't think so. You two are total little brats. You need a nap. Well, we just got here. We just woke up. It, it's not nap time. Yeah, it's not nap time. Wait, where are you taking me? Hey, I want to go back with my sister. <laughs> Daisy, wait up. I'll save you. I'll save you, Daisy. I'm coming. Ugh, it's so little. I can't walk fast. I really can't even walk at all. I'm more just crawling. Oh, he's a little cute little baby. No, put me down. I have to save my sister. Ow, you sort of dropped me. Stop dropping me. Excuse me, I'm in charge of these babies. And they need to go take a nap. Come on, little brat. I don't want you to call me a brat anymore. It's not nice. Oh, Molly, you made it into the nap room. Now, you two get in those beds and don't get out for the rest of the day. Whoa, they need to fire her. She is a really mean one. She is mean. I want to go home. <laughs> Daisy, don't cry. I have an idea. <laughs> it's a way we can escape. Is what? What should we do? We should play hide and seek on her. She's kind of a bully. Okay, um, who hides first? No, Daisy, we both hide from her. Okay, let's try to sneak out and hide on her. This is a good plan, Molly. You're so smart. I had to hit cops. <laughs> Ooh, um. No, don't go in there, Daisy. That's that's where they make stinky doo-doos. Okay, where could we hide? Um, um. What? Where did those babies go? I told them that they had to stay in their beds for the rest of the day. Hurry, Molly. She knows we're gone. Molly, hurry up. Oh my gosh, we're going to get caught. I just know it. How about right here, Molly? There's a good spot, right? I don't think so. You're going to get caught right away. I'm going to go hide over here. Um, ooh, bumper cars. No, Molly, she'll know where we are if we go play that. Don't do it. Staff office. <laughs> Time out corner. She'll never look for me in here. <laughs> I'm brilliant. Because why would she think I'd actually be in timeout? Where are you, babies? Hello, where are you? Daisy, come hide in here. Too late, Molly. Too late. Uh, I'm thirsty. Ah, there you are. I knew that you couldn't stay hidden for long. Ah, you found me. I need a bottle. Ah, I need a bottle, too. Oh, and there's your little bratty sister. Now, if you listened to what I said and took a nap, you wouldn't be so bratty. I'm not tired. I'm just thirsty. Okay, don't be a brat. I'll give you something to drink. Okay. 
Well, that's nice of you because I really need something to drink. Stop crying already, goodness gracious. Okay, look, I'm making your bottle, okay? Okay, I guess I won't cry then. But, um, I feel like, I feel like, uh oh. Ew, gross! You threw up before I even fed you the bottle? What's wrong with you? You can sit over there since you're like all throwy uppy and stuff. Aw. Ah, that hurt my feelings! Oh my gosh, why'd I get this job? Ugh, oh, here you go. Here's your bottle. Hmm. Now, where's that little bratty sister of yours? I don't know. But my tummy feels so full. Ha! Ah. Does that mean you're gonna throw up again? Ew! No, I'm not gonna throw up. Okay, well, uh, maybe a little. You stay here. Your sister will be back in no time. Oh, man. We have to try to hide better than last time. It didn't work! Here's your bratty sister. I need to potty! I need to potty! Ugh! You aren't potty trained yet? O-M-G. Well, just hold it till I go get a diaper, okay? Molly, I really want to go home. I really want to go poopy. <laughs> wow, you really do cry a lot. Maybe I'm prouder than I thought. Daisy, that's not very nice. Okay, Molly, well, that's a perfect time to go hide. Yeah, and let's find a potty on the way. I really need a diaper change. <laughs> Molly, you stop farting! Ew, it's gross and I'm following you! Um, okay, well, we could go in and change ourselves. And then we could go hide again. Sounds like a good plan. Definitely a good one. Oh, wait, look, there's some potties. I could just sit on the potty. Uh, uh, I'm not big enough. Also, I don't know how to give myself a diaper change. Will you change my diaper? No, Molly, I can't change your diaper. I'm not old enough. Okay, well, I guess I'm gonna go hide with the poo-poo in my pants then. Well, if you have to, Molly, but let's escape. Good idea. Wait, which is the way out? Okay, there's a way out. Come over here, Daisy. Coming, Molly. Stop picking me up! I need to escape! Stop it! You're not even that much bigger than me! Uh, Molly, she's a caregiver. No, you don't get to hold me. I don't want you to. Molly, come on. I'm trying to, but this girl keeps picking me up. Uh-oh. There's the caregiver in charge. What are you... Ew, what's that smell? Oh, I told you, hold on until I got a diaper. I couldn't hold it. I had to go poop. Ah! OMG, I need a vacation. Oh, that's a stinky, rotten one. Oh, that's gross. Oh. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Oh my gosh, stop wiggling. I still have to give you a diaper change. Maybe you just need a bath. I have to go potty again. Are you serious right now? You just went poo poo. How many poo poos can you have? Uh, I'll feel good. I'll go home and see my mommy. Oh my gosh, don't tell me you two have the stomach bug or something. No, we're just babies. We poop a lot. What do you want from us? Okay, fine. There, there. Now, let me just change this stinky diaper. Gross. Okay, I've changed way too many diapers. Just sit on the potty, would you? I'm not big enough to sit on the potty. What are you doing? Lady, you don't even know me at all. Molly, oh my goodness. Uh, look, Molly, you went poo-poo on the potty. Good for you. Whoa, I did go poo-poo on the potty. Today's a good day, cause I went poo poo on the party. Oh boy, here we go. All right, I'm gonna go hide. I, I can't deal with this caregiver anymore. Don't you dare pick me up, go away, go away! You can't just be wandering around by yourself. Ah, uh, yes I can. I'm a big kid now, baby escape. <laughs> Look it, they even labeled it. Daisy, oh Daisy. Can you find me? peek a -boo. Daisy, listen to me. Come underneath the stairs. You will find a vent and a little sign that says baby escape. This will be the best hiding spot you've ever had. Okay, now let's see where this goes. 
Oh my god, it goes outside! Freedom, sweet freedom! Molly! Look it! This is the best hide and seek I've ever done. Yeah, exactly. Now, where do we want to go? The mall, bumper cars. Molly, be careful! You're, you're crawling out into the stream! Don't worry, I look both ways, sort of. Whoa, water slides! I know, Molly, I think that's just a playground. We could definitely hide in that slide. Let's go before evil Sarah finds us. Good idea, Molly. Good idea. I can go first, okay? No, because you don't you don't Okay, yeah, you do sort of know how to go up there and hide. You're gonna fall down, Daisy. Oh, boy. Ugh, I can't even climb up there. I'm too fat. Uh, uh, move over. She'll never find us here. <laughs> Where did those babies go? Oh, my God, I'm gonna lose my job. I can't believe they just disappeared. Molly, Daisy, where are you? Come back, please. I need this job like my rent is due. I promise I'll be nicer. <laughs> Seed can't find us. Do, 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 do. <laughs> We've outsmarted her this time. When I find you, you're going to be in timeout forever. Do you have a cell phone, Daisy? No, Molly, of course not. Why would I have a cell phone? Because then we could call Mom. I want to go home. I want to go home too, Molly. Right now, though, I think I'll do a little self-soothing with my pacifier. I just get a cry. I want my mommy! <laughs> Whoa, look at the sandcastle I built. It's amazing. Whoa, Molly, I love it. You could almost go inside it. Yeah, <laughs> if I could, I would live at the beach forever. You would, Molly? I would actually just become a mermaid. I'd give up my human legs just so that I could get in the water. You mean like Ariel? No, Molly, the exact opposite. She wanted to be human. I want to be a mermaid. Yeah, we could. We could go in right now. Girls, stay out of the water. Molly, get out of the water. You don't know how to swim. Sorry, Mom. This is the perfect day, right, Daisy? Yeah, Molly, it really is. Um... If I never had to go to daycare again and mom could just watch us all day, it would be the perfect day. Well, girls, I'm really sorry, but I actually have to go to work this afternoon. What? No, I don't want you to have to go to work. That's not fair. <laughs> Molly, it's going to be okay. Daycare is really nice. No, daycare is not nice. Oh, Molly, I think you'll love daycare. You have the other times you've gone. No, there's a really rude daycare employee, and she's just, ugh, she's so annoying. She makes me sit on the potty. Yes, he took potty training us. I don't like it. <coughs> Molly, you're such a crybaby. It's starting to really annoy me. Ugh. I'm getting super tired. I need to go to the bathroom. I'm thirsty. Oh, I'm the crybaby? It's okay. Come on, girls. We'll go to daycare and I'll make sure that you can go potty and have a drink. And then I'll be t going off to work. What? No, I don't want you to go after work. Mom, wait. Come on, Molly. You're such a slow poke. Mom, my legs are like 20 times shorter than yours. Okay, look both ways. Ah, there's a car coming! Mom, help! Molly, hurry! Molly, stop! No, Molly, go! Oh my gosh. Molly, are you okay? Mom, your instructions were terrible. Stop, go, stay, go. Sorry, I just panicked a little bit. I noticed. Hey, put me down! I'm with my mommy! Stop it! Okay, Molly, okay, it's fine. It's just another caregiver. Whoa, they've got a unicorn pony in, in the um horse pen right now. Well, maybe your teacher will take you over to see it. Nah, we never do anything fun. Girls, come on now. I'm sure you do some things that are fun. No, it's terrible. I hate going to daycare. Oh, Molly, you're such a crybaby. I need a drink. I have to have a good party. I don't feel good. Again, I say who's a crybaby? It's definitely Daisy. Hey, Mario. Oh, hello, Molly. It's nice to see you. You too. If we have to be at daycare, at least you're here. I'm going to go play with some toys. Oh, who are you? Oh, that's our new student, Luke. 
Luke? Oh, wow. He is super cute. <laughs> I like him so much. A whole lot, actually. He's adorable. Hey, wait, come back with him. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, there you are. Hi. Hi, I'm Luke. I'm Molly. You're cute. You're cute, too. Aww. Wanna be my friend? Um, yeah. <laughs> wait, put me down. I'm hanging out with my new friend, Luke. Oh, you're so annoying. Here, just wiggle. There, see? They can't hold on to you. I have to go poo-poo. Oh, Daisy, just go to the potty already. Goodness. Hey, put my new boyfriend down. Boyfriend? I thought we were just friends. Me thirsty. Here you go. It's okay. Just drink your bottle. <laughs> oh, good baby. Luke, we're getting carried somewhere. Where do you think we're going? It looks like we're going to go to the beach. This looks like fun. I was already at the beach this morning. I'd rather hang out with Luke, though, so I guess I'm going to go wherever he goes. Luke, where are you going to go? Let's go over here. Okay. Are we supposed to go this far away, though, from the caregivers? I don't know, but they're kind of annoying. Let's just go spend time over here together. Oh, are we going to make a sand castle together? Oh, M.G., I think I'm in love. Oh, M.G., I think I'm in love. Uh, Luke, did you just hear me singing that? No, why? What were you singing? Uh, nothing. It's kind of embarrassing. Look, I got a rubber ducky. I kind of want you to have it, though. Really? Why? Because, um, uh, uh, I like you. What? You you like me? Seriously, you do? Yeah, you're really cute and you seem really nice. Well, we've only known each other for five minutes, but I love you! <laughs> Wait, you love me? Oh, uh, I, I don't know about that. I don't know if I like girls anymore. Bye! Wait, what? What just happened? He doesn't like me? I want my mommy. Wee! I love this unicorn. Oh my gosh, it's amazing. Hey, put me down. Wee! I need to talk to my sister. Stop it. I need to talk to my sister. Daisy, that Luke boy. I, I, I need to talk to you. Oh, yeah. Luke, who's that? Oh, sweet little baby. You're crying a lot. You might need a nap. You might need a nap, lady. And, and, and. And a bottle, too. Whoa, Molly, you're going to be in time out. <gasps> Who's that? He's adorable. You mean Luke? No, he's not adorable at all. He's rude, and I don't like him. Molly, I think he's handsome. No, no you don't. Take that back. No, I really like him. S stop, stop, stop saying that. Stop it right now. Boy, I'm getting kind of tired. But nothing can keep me away from my new crush. You're not allowed to have a crush on Luke. I do, though. Hi, I'm Luke. What's your name? My name's Daisy. Why are you so sad? I'm not sure I really like to spend time with girls. There was this girl, she said she loved me, and I'd only known her for five minutes. Ah, this horse is putting its bum bum on me. I need to go potty, but... I'd rather pee pee my pants than to miss this. Oh no, there's the girl. Oh, that's just my annoying sister. Don't pay attention to her. Now, what were you saying? You're dreamy. What? No! You two can't fall in love. It's not fair. I want to love Liv. I, I was right. Girls are crazy. Both of you. Ah! What did I say? He's just a boy. Boys are weird sometimes. I think so too. Wait, not really, but why, why did he think you were so crazy? Because I sort of fell in love with him. I had a baby crush on him. Oh, yeah. But if you only know him for five minutes, how'd you know? I don't know. I just did, okay? Why's everybody got to question me? Well, because, Molly, that doesn't make much sense. It does make sense. When you love somebody, you love them. 
Well, he obviously doesn't love you back, so your heart just needs to be broken. Really? Ah! But right now, what I really need to do is go poo poo! Ah! Oh, I waited too long and now I'm throwing up! Ew, Molly, I'm taking a nap! Don't throw up on me! Too late! to do problem number three from your workbook up here on the board in front of the class. Um, eh, uh, Come on, Molly, quit stalling. It's your turn at the board. If Michael has six eggs and Luke takes one egg and drops it and Sarah takes three eggs and cooks breakfast and Mitchell has an egg for his dog, how many eggs does is there left? Um, uh, uh. Molly, this is a review question. You should know this already. It's the end of the school year. Did you study at all? Um, well, um, no? Molly! Okay, that's it. You have detention! Oh, man! I need to find a new book to read. Ooh, what's this? A joke book? <laughs> Sounds exactly like the book I'd like to read. What do you get when you cross a snail with a porcupine? A slowpoke! <laughs> Excuse me, did you not read the sign? This is the library. Shh! <laughs> this is a funny joke, a slowpoke. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna read another. Um, what do you call an elephant that doesn't matter? And irrelevant. <laughs> excuse, excuse me. This is the library. Why are you so loud? Um. Well, why did you put a joke book in the library? Because if if you don't want me to be laughing and loud, you shouldn't have put a joke book in here. That's it. I'm writing you up. Oh boy, not again. Oh, hi, Matilda. Ooh, the pizza looks delicious today. Only one slice per student okay lunch lady okay hey what's that over there what's what <laughs> two slices for me oh yeah buddy she said only one who took that extra slice of pizza was that you molly i'm writing you up oh man mom i'm home from school oh just who i wanted to see why, did you make me cupcakes? Oh, you miss me so much, didn't you, Mom? Molly, I have so many slips from so many people here. You were naughty in the library. You you didn't do your math work. You, you were naughty in the lunchroom. Like, Molly, I have no choice but to take away your phone. My phone? You wouldn't dare. Molly, I am your mother and I'm not your friend. I, 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 I want to be your friend, but when you're naughty like this, I have to be your mother, so I'm sticking by my word. You're grounded from your phone for two weeks. What? Two weeks. Um, okay, Mom. I understand. Wait, what? What? You do? Yeah, I gotta go poo-poo. See you later. Okay. I'm glad we had this talk. Try not to get in trouble. Yeah, right. Trouble's my middle name. It's boring to be in the bathroom without your phone. That's okay. Mom will never know I'm playing on it. <laughs> Mom will never know if I'm playing Roblox in the bathroom. She'll just think I have a stomach ache. <laughs> Molly? Molly! I thought, ew, it smells funny in here. I know, I had to go to the bathroom. 
Well, but you're on your phone. I said you were grounded. Oh, man, you outsmarted me, Mom. Well, I am pretty smart, you know. And, and give me your phone right now. Oh, Mom. I'm going to lock your phone so you can't play Roblox for two weeks. Only emergency calls. That's what I'm locking it for. Oh, Mom, this is terrible. Why do you have to be so smart? Would you rather I was a dumb mom? Um, yes. That's precisely what I wish you would be. Molly, what is that? It's spell book? Where did you get that? The library. Apparently joke books aren't allowed, so I looked up this spell book on the computer and it said they had it in stock in the library, so I rented it. <laughs> now watch this. Alakazam! Alakazee! When I say dumb, that's what you'll be! What? What's happening? I feel... I feel... Exactly the same, Molly. That's a ridiculous spell book. Okay, if you say so, Mom. Molly, uh, you ate all the treats in the refrigerator and left a huge mess in the sink. Why don't you do these dishes? I would, Mom, but, um, I'm too dumb. <laughs> what did I just say? <laughs> I don't even remember. Whoa, Mom, are you okay? I think so. <laughs> I was, uh, what was I talking about? I can't remember. Uh, I think you said you were going to do the dishes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Wait, how do I turn on the water faucet? <laughs> uh, you, ju you just click right here like that. Oh, <laughs> good thing my daughter's so smart. <laughs> uh, okay, okay, Mom. As soon as she's done with these dishes, I'll say the word smart so she goes back to being normal. <laughs> she's a little crazy like this. Smart! Whoa, that was weird. I could have swore I asked Molly to do the dishes. <laughs> My plan is working perfectly. Mom won't mind if I get on Roblox on the computer. She just said I was grounded on my phone. <laughs> Loophole! Molly, what are you doing? You're not supposed to be playing Roblox. You're supposed to be doing your math homework. Um, well, I can't because it's too hard. And I'm too dumb. <laughs> what are you talking about, Molly? That math homework's probably super easy. <laughs> oh, yeah? You want to give it a try? What's one plus one? <laughs> well, one plus one what? Okay, one apple plus one apple equals how many apples? <laughs> Five! Oh my gosh. Did I get it right? <laughs> you didn't. <laughs> Not even close. Well, <laughs> if you don't understand your math, and neither do I, I guess you can't do it then. That's right, Mom. <laughs> I'm going to go watch some TV. Uh, but don't worry, Mom. You're really smart. Hmm. That's strange. Why am I standing in front of the computer? I'm not feeling very good today. Hi, everybody. I'm home. Oh, no. Here comes my annoying sister. She ruins everything. Molly, what exactly are you talking about? I'm the world's best sister. <laughs> yeah, right. Go away. I'm a little busy. Um, Molly, why don't you help me set the table for dinner? I would, Mom, but I'm feeling a little dumb. What? What did you say? Dumb. Dumb, 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 dumb. <laughs> what was I just doing? <laughs> Oh, I think I was making dinner, but I don't know how. How do, you, how do you boil water? I'm not really sure. What is going on with Mom? Molly, did you cast a spell on Mom? Yeah, so what if I did? She decided to ground me for my phone. Probably because you deserved it. You got written up five million times today. <gasps> Molly, this is evil. Go away. I don't need you to tell me what's good and bad. Oh, boy. I know how to solve this. Mom, you put the water on the stove and turn on the stove. And then you have to set the table. Oh, <laughs> you're right. I almost forgot. <laughs> you're smart, Mom. You'll figure it out. Whoa, what, what's going on with me? Molly, I'm going to give you one more chance 
to not do this anymore and reverse this spell. Nah. Um, wait. Uh, even if I wanted to, I, I don't know where the book is. That's because I have it. Daisy, give me back my spell book right now. I don't think so. Mom's rubble and your glue. Whatever you've cursed her with bounces off her and sticks to you. How's that for a spell? Dum, 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 dum! Whoa, I feel kind of dumb. <laughs> oh, wait, where did everybody go? Wow, is anybody home? <laughs> Molly, are you feeling okay? <laughs> Molly, can you speak English? Or human even? I don't know. <laughs> I feel kind of dumb. <laughs> oh my gosh, Molly. You're drooling on yourself. Oh my goodness. We better take you to the hospital. I think you might have a concussion. <laughs> uh, yeah, you're definitely messed up. Mom, can I have a snack? Molly, I'm trying to finish up some work right now in my room. Mom, can, can I have a snack, though? Did you finish your homework? Um, no, but I need a snack because I need brain power to finish it. Okay, Molly. Can I have a cookie? No, Molly, you have to eat something healthy. Okay, fine. Healthy food. Always healthy food with you, Mom. Well, Molly, you said you needed brain power. Unhealthy food's not going to give you brain power. Okay, yeah, I guess you're right. Um, what should I have? Ooh, I'm gonna have a yogurt first. That sounds delicious. Mmm, it's strawberry, my favorite. Molly, what are you doing? Daisy, I hear you, but I don't see you. Why is that? Have you turned into a ghost? Oh my gosh! Molly, I'm right here. Oh, I thought you were a ghost. Maybe you are. <gasps> Why can't I walk through you? Molly, that's because we're in Blacksburg. So what you're saying is everybody in Blacksburg is a ghost. Ay, ay, ay. Hey, I was just wondering, did you finish your math homework? No, I'm too busy eating everything in the refrigerator. Molly, you're going to get a bad grade. Ooh, look at this tasty banana. I want to eat that next. Molly, stop stuffing your face with all that food and come on. No, I, I didn't do my math homework. What do you want me to say? Well, I didn't quite understand problem number 10, and I was wondering if maybe you knew how to do it. Nope, because I didn't even try yet. Too busy eating all this food. Oh, yeah, you are no help at all, Molly. No help at all. Daisy, make sure you get your snack because it's almost bedtime. You're going to have to brush your teeth and stuff soon. Um, okay, I'm, I'm going to eat something healthy. I'm going to eat something healthy because I'm a goody two shoes. Molly, stop teasing your sister. Okay, sorry. I'm really not sorry, Daisy. Molly. Yeah, okay, I'm really sorry. <laughs> you got it, Tabba. <laughs> Just eat your snack, Daisy, and leave me be. Okay, fine, Molly. Bye. Where's baby Kira anyway? Doesn't she have to go to bed? Baby Kira? Baby Kira, where are you? I do do bye, do 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 da do. Ew, baby Kara, you have a stinky diaper, gross. I do do bye, da do da do do. Molly, we're making a band. It's called Three Sisters Band. You wanna be in it? Um, what instrument will I play? Well, there's no more instruments left. Okay, I'll be the I'll be the singer. What should I sing? Do bye, twinkle twinkle. Okay, baby Kara wants me to sing Twinkle Twinkle. I've got to do it with my nose plug now because baby Kara has a stinky diaper and it smells horrible. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. Molly, seriously, that sounds terrible. Unplug your nose. Okay. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. How I wonder what you are. Molly, you're fired. You're a bad lead singer. Hey! Girls, come on. Baby Kira, come here, please, so I can change your diaper. Yeah, you need to change diaper. And look at you. You're super tired. You need to go to bed next. You're super sleepy. Okay, I'm going to go in, finish up my homework, 
Guys, oh, it's almost time for bed. There's like no time to do anything fun on a school night, really. Seriously, you go to school from 7 o'clock in the morning till 3.30 in the afternoon. Then you spend a half an hour on the school bus. By the time you get off the bus, you got to do all this homework, do all these chores. You have like 10 minutes to play. Then you got to go to bed and do it all over. I don't like that. No, I don't. Let's see. Problem number 10. Hey, Daisy, did you get problem number 10 in our math homework? No, Molly, I already told you that. I don't know how to do it. Oh, man. I don't know what this answer is. Um, I'll just close my eyes and guess. You're going to fail, Molly. That's rude. Why are you saying I'm going to fail? Because you are, Molly, if you just guess. <sighs> oh, getting so tired right now. Uh, well, why are you in your book at me, then? Why don't you go to bed? I'm going, Molly. Oh, good night, Molly. Good night, Daisy. Okay, I just have a little bit more homework. Ah, I better go brush my teeth, though. Actually, first I better take a bath, because I don't want to be stinky for school tomorrow. Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do. I love Roblox, yes, I do. I love Roblox, how about you? Do-do-do. I love Roblox, yes, I do. I love Roblox, how about you? If you love Roblox, slam that like button! Come on, guys, give this video a huge thumbs up! Okay, now I'm gonna brush my teeth. Brush it, 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 brush Brushing my teeth, brushing my teeth. Molly, if you're talking while you're brushing, you're not doing a good job. Who are you, my mom? Stop bugging me, Daisy. Okay, all done. Ugh, my night routine takes forever. Where is everybody? Baby Kira? <coughs> oh my gosh, guys, baby Kira is sleeping in her bed. She looks so adorable. Look how cute she looks. Night night, baby Kira. You're so adorable. Sweet dreams. Mom forgot to close her door, so I'm going to close it. Now I'm going to go see what Daisy's doing. Daisy! Daisy! <sniffs> Daisy! Daisy! Molly, seriously? You just woke me up. What do you want? I just wanted to say, Good night, Daisy! Molly, you could have said that in the morning. No, I couldn't, Daisy. If I said it in the morning, that wouldn't make any sense. I wouldn't say good morning in the morning. I would say... I mean, I wouldn't say good night in the morning. I would say good morning in the morning. You're confusing me, Molly. Get out of my room, please. Good night. Oh, Daisy, you're so cute. Oh, don't you want me to stay in here and hang out with you? Molly, you need to go to bed. Sheesh. Fine, no one wants to hang out with me. Guess I'll just go watch Barley Colored Unicorn in the hot tub. The news, the cooking channel. Yes, here it is. The Barley Colored Unicorn, the Barley Colored Unicorn. Do, 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 do. Ah. This is the life. Molly, what are you doing? Are you in bed yet? Uh, yeah? Molly, I can hear the hot tub running. Go get in bed. Okay. Good night, Mom. Good night, Molly. Now, don't wake up your sisters. I'm not even tired yet. What am I going to do right now? I know. I'll jump on my bed. That'll get rid of some of the energy that I have. <laughs> Boing, 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 boing. Molly, you're going to wake up your sisters. Too late, Mom. She already woke me up. And now I'm going to go yell at her for it. Oh, no, I've got to hide. Here comes my sister. Okay, she won't find me in here. <laughs> oh, oh, my gosh. Oopsie, excuse me. Ew, Molly, gross. <laughs> you would have never found me if you hadn't heard that. Marty, seriously? <laughs> ay, ay, ay. You're waking up the whole house. Go to sleep. It's, you're so crazy. Instead, I think I'm going to play with my toys. Well, do it quietly. Hey, Daisy, did you just turn the light off? Oh. I'm kind of a night owl, so it's like, I don't know. I don't want to go to sleep yet. <gasps> do you guys dare me to sneak into my sister's room? <laughs> Gotta be really quiet.
Where's Daisy? She's not... <gasps> Daisy's missing! Ah! Get out of my room! Ah! You scared me, Daisy! What are you doing? That's what you get for trying to scare me. Okay, on off, on off, on off, on off, on off. Girls, are you guys still up? It's a Molly's fault! You're both going to be grounded if you don't go to bed. It's getting really late. Okay, Mom. Thanks, Molly. You're going to get me detention. Detention? Don't you mean grounding? Yeah, same thing. I never get a detention or grounding. Well, if you don't be quiet, you will. I'm not the one that's being loud. It's you. Now get out, please. Hey, somebody's outside. Who's that? Who is that? I know I just saw somebody in the pool. Did you guys see that? Hey, what are you doing? You should go to bed. It's it, We have school tomorrow. Uh, I kind of lost my way home. Well, you can come in and call your mom if you need to, but I, I think I just saw somebody in the pool. I thought it was my sister, baby Kira. No, it's okay. I have my cell phone. I'll just call my mom. Okay, well, see you at school tomorrow. Oh my gosh, someone just walked into our house. And they have a monkey on their head. <laughs> Molly, are you not asleep? It's not my fault. All these people are coming over from school and they want to have a party. Oh, this is so crazy. All right, guys. I'm going to give a shout out to Arna300. And who's this guy that's at the door? Um, I can't see his name. I'm going to let him in. Okay, come on in. What's your name? Super Devin 111 Thanks, guys, so much for being fans. And we'll see you in our next video. Molly, you have a time out. Like right now or like in the morning? In the morning, Molly. Right now, go to bed. Okay, guys, I have to go to bed for real. <laughs> or I'm going to get in even more trouble. My mom says I have a time out tomorrow because I'm not going to bed. So, see you guys later. Good morning, girls. I'm just about to make breakfast. Oh, boy, Mom, can we have pancakes? Sorry, Molly, I don't have the ingredients for pancakes this week. But, Mom, I really want pancakes. Come on, it's summer vacation. Yeah, that sounds really good, Mom, please. I'm sorry, girls. Uh, there, There's no pancake mix, and I don't have money for that this week, okay? Fine. Dizzy, why are you just staring at the empty TV screen with nothing on it? Well, I'm imagining that we had cable. What do you mean? We, we don't? No, girls, I'm sorry. Your dad and I are trying to save money, so um, we decided to take the cable out. There's still the news station, though. The news station? Who wants to watch that garbage, Mom? Oh, that's so boring. Wait a minute. Is that a leftover piece of pizza? Mine! I claim it! Mm, so good, Mom. You make the best homemade pizza ever. Molly, that's weird to eat that for breakfast. I think it's delicious. Mm. So, Daisy, would you like some oatmeal for breakfast? No, I'm not really even hungry. <sighs> I wish we could go with everyone else somewhere today. What do you mean? Where is everyone going? Oh, everyone in our school and their families are going to the water park in Brookhaven. Wow, that sounds like so much fun. Uh, how much does it cost? Uh, it's like $50 a person. Per person? Per family? That's right, Mom. So it would be about $200 for us to go. $200? What's the school crazy? We can't afford that. Oh, Mom. Come on. Can't we go, please? You must have a little bit in your, um, in your wallet or something, right? I only have like $3, and I have to use that for gas money to get to, to my job, girls. Like, I don't have $200 to take you to the water park. This is the most terrible summer ever. It's just, I hate being poor. I hate it. <laughs> Ugh, I feel like a horrible mom. I wish I could afford to take you girls to the water park. Molly, come here, please. What? I'm pouting in my room. What do you want? Now I'm going to pout in the bathroom. Molly, come out here, please. What? You made Mom feel really sad. I'm really sorry, girls, that I can't give you more things. Like, 
you know, expensive tickets to water parks and, and beautiful clothes, but I love you more than anything, and I always make sure you have a roof over your head, even if it leaks a little. And, and, and I'm food in your belly, even though it's not always exactly what you want. I always make sure that you know that I love you so much, and I hope someday you'll know that that's enough. I didn't want to tell you girls this. I wanted it to be a surprise, but since you're so sad about the water park, I guess I'll tell you now. We're going to Disney? Whoa, Mom, this is amazing! Molly, she didn't say we were going to Disney. Ay, ay, ay. No, your dad and I managed to save up to take you girls to the ice cream shop. Wait, what? That's all we're doing all summer? Ugh, I knew you wouldn't be very impressed. It's all we can afford, girls. We're only getting ice cream one time this summer. Ugh, working three jobs is just killing me. Ugh, I've been working on cutting down all these trees to make lumber all day. And it's exhausting. Well, I guess now's the perfect time to get that ice cream, Dad, since you look really hot. I am. It's 100 degrees outside. Wait, you told the girls about our surprise trip? Well, I had to. They wanted to go to the water park, and we can't afford to send them, even though they're the only ones at school that aren't going to be able to go. Oh, we failed as parents. No, you didn't. We're happy that we get to eat ice cream, right, Daisy? Yeah, I'm going to get my favorite. But only one scoop. It's all we can afford. Okay, well, let's get going, guys. Come on, girls, get in. Dad, are you sure you don't just want to walk? I mean, your car has a habit of actually not getting us anywhere, ever. It's always breaking down. Yeah, and it smells like a rotten egg fart. <laughs> oh, it doesn't smell that bad. Yes, it does, Dad. It literally smells like a giant fart. What's wrong with your car? Uh, the girls do have a point, honey. It does smell pretty bad. Well, hopefully it just gets us there. That's all I care about. Uh, Dad? I smell something really funny. Oh, sorry, that was me. <laughs> Leftover pizza does it to me every time. Ah, oh, maybe it wasn't your car that smelled like a rotten egg fart. Maybe it was Molly this whole time. Ew, Molly. What? What? We have money to go through the car wash? No, it's free car wash day. We need to take care of that smell. But Dad, we're, ah, we're getting soaked, Dad! Well, you're the one that I think is making it smell like a rotten egg fart, so Molly, you need a bath. We could all use a bath. The water's not running at the house real well these days. Ah! <laughs> I got soap in my hair! I think that's kind of the point, Dad. Not only does the car get washed, we do too! Free baths for everyone! Now that we're all clean and smell good, we can go into the ice cream shop. I can't believe it! The car actually made it this time. <laughs> Let's see, what kind of flavors do I want? Remember, Molly, just one scoop. It's all we can afford. Oh, well, I'm definitely getting my favorite mint chocolate chip. Mm, that's so good. So good. Mm. Whoa, who's that? They're pulling up in a limo, Daisy. Whoa, they look so rich. I bet they're the rip richest people in all of Brookhaven. Ooh, I'm going to get a scoop of everything. Then I'm going to go to the Louis Vuitton store and buy five new purses. Oh, honey. <laughs> Slow down with all this spending of our money. Just kidding. We're billionaires. You can have anything you want. Whatever makes your heart happy. Oh, dear. You're so sweet. Wow. Wonder what it's like to be that rich. Yeah, Molly, me too. I can see it now. This is gonna be the perfect spot for my new mansion. Let's see, which mansion do I want? I am so rich, I can have anyone I every anyone I want, really. Um, it just depends on the the one I think is the cutest. Oh, MG, this one's really cool. This is the one I'm gonna have in Brookhaven, but I'm also gonna have one in Hawaii. And I'm going to have one in Malibu. So this is just my Brookhaven one. Wow. Look at my new house. It's amazing. I'm so rich that I had an architect build this house completely off center. Look at it. <laughs> it's like I'm falling down no matter where I am in the house. This house cost me $4 million. 
It was worth every, every penny. Sometimes I just lay money down as my pillow and I, I sleep on it because that's how rich I am. Like I can make money into pillows. Sometimes I even take a bath in money. I'm so rich. I'm so rich. Stacks of cash. Stacks of cash. I got me stacks of cash. I think I'm going to go buy a fancy sports car like right now. What kind of sports car would I want? I could buy a school bus. Yeah, I'm going to buy a school bus and a sports car because that's kind of funny. Ooh, look at this. I really like this. Okay, I'm buying that. It's like not letting me. Okay, fine. I'll try this sports car then. This one's better than that pink one anyway. Oh, uh, yeah. Look at my new car. Oh, I'm so rich. It's just like the best thing in the world. Ah, time to go to the beach. Ah, as soon as I learn how to drive. <laughs> I totally ran into my new house. Oh, well, I'll just buy a new garage if I ruin this one. Ah, why won't the wheel turn? Obviously, I need to hire our driver. I can do that. I'm rich, you know. I'll also hire a chef and I'll hire, I'll hire everything. I'll hire a housekeeper. And when you're rich, you can do whatever you want. You can sit on the beach all day, just counting your money and feeling the sunshine on your face. <sighs> and guess what? You never have to go to school ever again. Whoa, 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 Molly. What are you talking about? What do you mean what am I talking about? The rich have the best life ever. They still have to go to school, Molly, whether you're rich or not. Nope. Mm. If I had all the money in the world, no more school for me. Molly, it's against the law to not go to school. You have to go to school. Okay, but the teachers would work for me. That means no more detention. Yeah, if you say so, Molly. Molly, would you really want to be rich? Well, yeah. Wouldn't be ri being rich be awesome? Yeah, but you'd have different parents and a different sister and everything. Mm, yeah, I guess that's true. So, would you still want to be rich? Well... I sure would miss my mom and my dad. Hey, where's mom? Sorry, I had to go put another quarter in the parking meter. Ugh, it was the last quarter I had to. Well, maybe I can find another one under the couch cushion. <laughs> maybe we could save up and bring the girls back to the ice cream shop one other time this summer. That would be so nice. As much as being rich would be amazing, I sure would miss my mom and dad and sister. Really, Molly? You, you wouldn't, you wouldn't want to be rich? Nah. Not if I couldn't be rich with you guys. And you guys, well, are poor. So I'm going to stay being a family with you guys. Oh, Molly, that's amazing. And when I grow up, I'm going to do something awesome, like be a doctor, or a rocket scientist or something. And I'm going to make sure that I buy us all a really nice house. Oh, Molly, you don't have to do that. But you're such a sweetheart for saying it. Yeah, no money can buy an amazing family. And mine sure does love me a whole lot. Oh my gosh, I have a babysitter. You know what that means? Pizza night! Oh, <laughs> uh, think again. <laughs> Your mom and dad left you with the worst babysitter in town. What? No! Guys, I have to escape this grumpy babysitter! She looks really evil. <laughs> yeah, right. Like you'll ever escape me? You're just, well, you're just a little silly kid. I'm not a little silly kid. I don't even need a babysitter. By the way, where are your pants? I don't even see any pants. Seriously. You came to work as a babysitter and you forgot to get dressed. You like went from pajamas to no pants. Nice. Don't touch these shirts. She's booby trapped them. Oh, that's what she did. Instead of um, getting dressed like she was supposed to, she booby trapped them. Watch out for those spikes. Oh, look at her. She didn't make it. Go to your room, like, right now. I need to call all my friends. Ugh. No! I'm not going to my room. Yes, you are. Well, how am I even supposed to get to my room? There's all these spikes everywhere. Ah! I ran into the bed and it was booby-trapped! Holy guacamole. This babysitter's crazy. This babysitter's crazy. This babysitter's crazy. I'm out of here. Great. You got out. Now let's find a way out through these bushes. Oh, my God. There's a huge maze out here. How am I going to get out of here? Guys, if you think I can escape this grumpy babysitter, slam that 
like button! Um, are those the same clothes I saw before? <laughs> I'm so confused. Yes, I made it! Okay, you have to go in order or you die. That's what I think. One, two, three, four, five. Look, guys, I can count to five. <laughs> Aren't you proud of me? Oh, but I didn't... It didn't save me from dying. Oops. Now I have to count to five all over again? Oh, math is hard. Just kidding. I'm actually really good at math. Especially when I'm counting cupcakes. <laughs> Whoa, what? I didn't even touch anything bad. Oh. All right, guys. I don't know why, but this... Oh, it's starting me right here. Yay. Guys, this part's a little hard, so I'm going to need the power of the unicorn. Are you guys ready? Say it with me. Power of the unicorn with the spikely horn. If you guys have never been here before, then um, you don't know about my magic unicorn, so I'll tell you right now. I adopted a magic unicorn, and her magic comes from her horn. That's why I say, with a magical horn. Just in case you didn't know. I mean, not everybody knows about unicorns. Hurry up. Your dinner is ready. It better be pizza, you crazy babysitter. Whatever. You think I'm going to give you pizza? Uh, yeah? <laughs> Seriously, what is going on? Oh, man. The babysitter forgot to wear pants today. <laughs> Looks like someone spilled the tea. I don't want to drink tea for lunch. I will drink this hot cocoa, though. Oh, look at the marshmallow. It has a cute little smiley face. Oh, I ran into a knife. Oh, that's going to sting. Holy guacamole. Holy guacamole. Boing. Oh, I keep dying here. Unicorn, where are you? I need you, unicorn. Is anybody else obsessed with this hot cocoa? The marshmallow is like cute and a little creepy. Like, look at him. He's like, hi, I'm a cute little marshmallow. Hi, 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 hi. <laughs> Are you evil too, marshmallow? I'm sorry, but you do look a tiny bit evil. No offense. All right, let's go. Where are we going next? Into some slime. Just kidding. I'm not going to touch that. A Trixie Bridges. Okay, this was the incorrect one. Do not choose left. If you are stuck with this evil babysitter in town, don't choose right either. This grumpy babysitter, I've had enough. We're going down these Trixie Bridges. Yes! Ow, I ran into the wall. <laughs> I hate when I do that. I don't think you can touch these bouncy balls. No, you can't. They're like giant gumballs. Something tells me I'm going to have to climb up that fireplace to get out of here like Santa does. <laughs> Do I look like Santa to you? Okay, I think there's a way to cheat through this. Just, there we go. <laughs> yep, I went up the chimney. Ho, ho, ho. Just call me Molly Claus. Does anybody else not understand what's going on here? Yeah, me too. Oh, don't touch the ground. If you fall that far, yep, you die. Well, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Can't go up here. Hmm. I don't I don't understand. Where am I supposed to go next? I'm doomed. I'm stuck with this babysitter forever. Yeah, I definitely can't go that way. Um I don't know. Maybe I'm supposed to jump here. Yeah, okay, I did it. I don't know if I'm going the wrong way. Oh, my God! <laughs> my feet fell off. That was sad. See, there's some over there, too, but I guess they don't go anywhere. Oh, this is ridiculous! Guys, I don't know if I can do it. I need a pep talk. Can you guys leave me a cupcake emoji in the comment section below? To me, that's a pep talk. <laughs> oh, I landed on it that time, but I landed on the part that electrocuted me. Oopsie. 
Oh, come on. This is not even good. This part of the game is ridiculous. Well, oh, no! <laughs> I almost made it, but not really. I'm really tempted to click the skip level button right here. I'm really tempted, guys. They made this part impossible. You literally cannot make it through this part, I'm telling you. I'm a Roblox video star, which means I know how to play me some Roblox. And this is impossible. It really is. It's impossible, people. Maybe if I go down here farther. <laughs> how many times can I die in one game? Have I told you guys that we have new merch on our website yet? Oh my gosh, guys. You should totally check it out. Uh, it's the, the web address is... Whoa, I made it! Star squad dot shop and I really think you guys are gonna love it there's piggy shirts on there there's piggy shirts on there and there's shirts with me and Daisy there's uh backpacks there's oh my gosh pillows there's so many cool stuff th things that are on there now I love all of the stuff so you guys should check it out oh my gosh is this the end did I escape the grumpy babysitter oh no I've got to go into the sewer now too Holy guacamole, watch out for the poisoned water. I don't know. I think I could just stay with the grumpy babysitter. I don't want to go into the sewer. Ew. Wait, you see the end? <gasps> they arrested the grumpy babysitter? That's because you didn't give me pizza for dinner. This is no babysitter. This is an inmate. Oh my gosh. Um... I don't know, but this was crazy. <laughs> uh, okay, wait. Let's let's do one of these. This will be fun. Let's do yellow. Yellow doesn't work. Just give me what I want! Does the red work? Nothing works. I made it through here, and nothing works. Can I go in this house? Oh, you can't go in the house. Can I, can I drive your car? No. That's, police ca that's a police car. So... Still want to drive it. None of these work! Bummer! But in any case, guys, I did actually escape the grumpy babysitter. Do you think you guys could escape the grumpy babysitter? Let me know in the comment section below. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button, guys, so you can be one of our number one fans. And also hit the notification bell so you can see as soon as I put out a new video. Guys, you're amazing. I love you guys so much. You're the best fans in the world. I'll see you next time. Bye! I'm out of here. I'm going to get a pizza. I don't want to use a potty chair. Um, you have to be a big girl now and use the potty if you want to go to the water park today. No, I'm going to go poop poop in my diaper. Oh, that's not what big girls do. Too late. Oh, Molly. All right, I guess we'll have to give you a bath. I don't want a bath either. Well, if you have to be a naughty baby... Then you're going to have to sit in timeout instead of going to the water park. You don't want that, do you? No, I just don't want a bath. Well, I'm getting ready for the water park. See? See my cute little outfit? This is exactly what I've got to go to the water park. And you can get a cute little outfit to go too, as long as you're good. Now, you need to take a little nap, and then we'll be all ready to go. La, la, la. I'm not going to sleep, lady. Oh, come on. I'll sing you the nicest lullaby. I'm not going to sleep! Oh wait, nope, nope, yes I am. <coughs> oh, I had a bad dream! <coughs> and I'm coughing! I want my teacher! <laughs> oh my, it seems that you both have a little bit of a cough. <coughs> I'm gonna go to the water park, you promise, lady! Well, first we need to give you some cough medicine because Daisy's got a cough too. Yeah, and I kinda wanna go home. Daisy, you don't wanna go home. We're not calling mom. We're going to the water park. I had to try to go to the bathroom and the potty and then I had to get a bath. I had to do all this stuff and, and I'm going to that water park. Well, I'm kind of hungry too. Are you hungry, Molly? No. <coughs> I just have this cough I can't get rid of. Okay, girls, well, here we are at the doctor's office. I just need to give you a little bit of cough medicine, 
and you probably will feel good enough to go to the water park, okay? I'm better, lady. Oh, wow. I do feel all better. <laughs> I'm gonna go to the water park. Yay! Molly, wait up. I need to take my medicine, too, and then we can go to Gavel. Not waiting. Oh, um, gee, I can't wait to see it. It's going to be beautiful. I know this new water park is going to be amazing. <gasps> it totally is. Look at it. Donut water park. My kind of water park. It's amazing. There's an ice cream truck out front. And then, then, then there's water and there's slides and there's, there's beach balls and there's pools. And OMG, it's amazing. Dizzy, seriously, are you crying at the water park? I was for a minute, but now I'm super happy. Why were you crying? I, I, I'm just so excited. I can't take it. Oh my gosh, my sister's kind of cray cray. Girls, don't go in water that's over your head though, okay? Um, yeah, we'll try not to, but no promises. <laughs> Girls, do you either one of you know how to, to swim? Uh, no. Well, I guess you could have swim lessons. Nah, we don't need swimming. We'll be just fine. Actually, if you're in the water and you don't know how to swim, then you need to be wearing a life jacket. Oh, this lady. Nag, 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 nag. Ha ha! Going down the water slide. It's gonna be, whoa, super fun! Whee! Um, now might be a time to worry about not being able to swim! Just stand up. The water's not even deep now, cheapers. Ow, I hit my knee and I scraped it. <laughs> it's making me mad. Whoa, it sounds like someone needs a time out. Come on, Marty, turn that frown upside down. We could splash in the water park. It'll be fun. You're, you're ugly. Oh. What? That's it, Molly. Time out for you. That's such a mean thing to say. Why are you so grumpy? I just am. It's because I'm a baby. <laughs> All right, well, time out for you, my dear. Why don't you stand right there and think about what you did and said, and when you're ready to join us and be a good girl, you can get out of time out. Fine! I don't like you anyway, lady. Look at my knee. It's got a cut on it. I hit it on the bottom of the pool and no one even cares. <laughs> Molly, you're supposed to be spending this time thinking about what you said to Daisy. I hurt my knee, lady. I hurt my knee. Oh, wow. You hurt your arm and your knee. Oh, my gosh. I can't believe you scraped the bottom of the pool, Molly. Everything will be okay. Um, It just looks like they're little scrapes. I want my mommy. La la la, la la la, la 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 la. Is this lady for real right now? That's not helping. Molly, just try to listen to this. Hush, little baby, don't say a word. I'm gonna buy you a mockingbird. Whoa, that's working. I don't want it to work. I'm, I want to be grumpy. Molly, come on, you're at the water park. Don't you want to have a good time? Yeah, okay. Now remember what I said, be careful in the water, okay? And no more timeouts. Okay, fine. Come on, Daisy, let's go down another slide. I don't know, I can't swim. And I saw what happened to you, you gotta scrape. Yeah, but don't be a chicken, come on, let's go. Oh man, this one looks super, super, super cool. It's like a rainbow slide. Whoa, whoa, uh-oh, I'm stuck. Teacher! I need help, I'm stuck in the water slide. Uh-oh, I'm, I'm never gonna be able to come down here. Wait, wait, I think I just walked down it. Molly, are you okay? Yeah, I got stuck in the water slide, but, oh, whoa, my teacher came right up here and got me. Oh, I didn't know you could do that. We are magic like that, Molly. Uh, teacher? Daisy's under the water. Daisy, Daisy, oh my gosh, are you okay? I think I might have been drowning, but I'm okay. Um, Daisy, that's that's not okay to be drowning. Girls, you need to be careful. This water is only as deep as your knees, but the two of you keep going under the water. Be very careful. We will. Hey, don't, don't splash me. You'll, you'll mess up my makeup. You're going to the water park, lady. Why'd you care about your makeup? Oh, I guess you're right. 
Come on, let's have a slash fight. Yeah! I'm thirsty. Well, drink some of this water I'm splashing at you. Ha ha ha! Rude, Molly! Daisy, there's nothing wrong with drinking pool water. I think it's delicious. Ew, Molly! Probably someone with pee-pee in there. Yeah, me. I had to go. Ew, Molly! Do you know what you're just saying right now? Ew, gross! Oh, it's not that gross. Try it! You need water and there's a whole lot here. Molly peed in the pool! Molly? Ah, uh, this is our ool. Please leave the pee out. <laughs> I see what you did there. <laughs> that was super funny. <laughs> Maybe you babies are just too little to bring to the water park. Wait, what? No! No, lady, we're not too we're not too little. Ah, I don't know, Molly. Maybe next year you'll be mature enough to come to the water park. Right now, though, I think we better take you both to the potty and have something to eat. And maybe a nap. What? No! I'm gonna go back to the water park! I only rode like two slides! And for right now, that's enough. You kids have needs, and eating and drinking and going to the potty chair are all things you need to do. That's lame. I wanna wear a diaper forever. I don't. I want to be a big girl. I don't want to be peeing in the water park pool. Well, I don't care. I want to be at the water park, so if I have to pee in the pool, I don't care. But I don't I don't want to sit on this potty chair anymore. Getting off of it. Good job, Molly. You peed in the potty. I didn't want to, though. You forced me to. I am hungry, though. Let's have a snack and let's go back to the pool. Can you be good, Molly? Um, yeah, sure. I can be really good. <laughs> Watch this. Oh, do I not have enough money? I really want to slime my teacher. Hmm, I've got to think of another way to be naughty. <laughs> I know how to be naughty. I took Daisy's favorite rubber ducky. Now she won't have it for bath time at Twilight Daycare. <laughs> oh, I love being evil. Molly, have you seen my rubber ducky? Um, no, I haven't seen it at all. Molly, you're holding my rubber ducky. Girls, are you fighting again? Yeah, but you're not the lady who takes care of us, so bye. Rude. I can still report you and give you time out. She took my rubber ducky. Yep, because I'm naughty, and everybody knows it. <laughs> Molly, you drop that rubber ducky right now. Not a chance. Molly, did you take Daisy's toy? You're not going to go back to the water park. I'm going back. I'm Wait, why are you picking me up, lady? You're not going back. You're being very naughty. You know what that means? You need a nap. No, I don't want a nap. Get, let go of me. Let, let go. Molly, you need a nap. Now get in your crib. I'm going to give you two seconds. Hey, okay, fine, I'm in here. But I'm not going to sleep, lady. I'm not doing it. I don't want to take a nap. <laughs> changed your pajamas and by the way it's noon why are you still in your pajamas daisy can't you see i'm busy mitch just died on survivor molly that show isn't even real it's so real in my heart it's real Ugh. i gotta eat some more doritos it'll make me feel better molly you're getting crumbs all over the couch Ugh, you're the laziest sister on the planet what are you talking about I, i'm not lazy I, i'm just choosing this life what is that you have? Some college applications. Dizzy, you're not going to college next year. I like to be overly prepared, and I'm thinking either Harvard or Yale. Yale or Harvard. I'm just thinking, I'm not going to make it through the rest of my life now that Mitch is dead. Molly, you really start, you need to stop thinking about your future. Um, I am. I'm sitting on the couch watching Survivor eating Doritos. Sounds like an amazing future. Molly, I'm telling you, if you don't get it together, you're going to be homeless, living in a box behind Brookhaven Dino. Well, that's not a very nice thing to say. I speak the truth, Molly. Well, how about this? I use that fancy smancy time machine that you created in your secret lab, and I go to the future and see what it's like. 
you wouldn't dare. Oh, try me. But first, I need to have enough energy to get to the future. Which means I gotta eat this entire bag of Doritos. Mm, that's delicious. Oh, brother. I can't even begin to imagine what your future's gonna look like. Molly, are you sure this is a good idea? Sure, I'm sure it is. Sure, 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 sure. And also sure. Wow, you annoying. Hopefully you're less annoying in the future. I hope I'm more annoying. Annoying, 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 annoying. You couldn't even bother to change out of your pajamas. Why? I want to be comfy in the future. <sniffs> Ew, Molly. I got a little too comfortable. <laughs> Molly, step into the time machine, please. Okay. Well, see you in the future. <laughs> Gosh, it worked! She vanished! What's this place? And why is it in my future? Oh my gosh, I have no food to feed any of my children! I hope Luke stopped at the grocery store like I asked him to. Honey, sweetie, I'm home! And I got a new little baby for you! Another little baby? Holy guacamole, that's a lot of babies! I named this one Jerry! Oh, hi Jerry. Honey, we don't really have any more money for kids. Well, I couldn't just leave him there at the adoption center by himself, could I? I guess not. Did you stop at the grocery store like I asked? We're out of milk and eggs and bread. How will I make French toast for dinner? It's your favorite. Oh, honey, I I had to get some new wheels for my race car. I, I, I couldn't get any of that stuff. But I have to feed the children. Oh, yeah. Well, um, yeah. We could, we could go foraging in the forest for some stuff. And wild berries and crab apples and... Ew, you know what crab apples does to me. <clears throat> oh, honey, that was a good one. <laughs> wow, it stink terrible, though. Did you pick up the toothpaste like I asked? Um, no, I'm sorry, honey. I couldn't afford it. The wheels were so expensive. But, honey, I only have... Um, wait, let me count my teeth again. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. I only have seven teeth left, okay? And one of them's giving me a toothache. Like, I need to start brushing my teeth. I need toothpaste before I lose all of them. Mommy, I'm hungry. Oh, Susie, I'm sorry, but your daddy didn't pick up any food. Maybe we could chew on his race car wheels. Well, I'm sorry, honey, but when I win that big race, you know what's going to happen. We're going to have all the money in the world. We don't even have a couch to sit on. Luke, why did I marry you? That was the worst day of my life. I made a horrible decision. Well, I've been working down in the Quickie Mart. I don't see you having a job. Hi, Mommy. Oh, hi, Mandy. Oh, wait, what was your name again? You never gave me a name. You said you'll get around to it, but you had too many other kids. Oh, well, um, well, you look like this girl I went to school with. Your name is Sarah. Yeah, that's it. Well, honey, why can't you get a job? Well, look at all these kids. Who's going to watch all of them? Oh, yeah, and there's also 10 more at school right now. They'll be getting home soon want something to eat. We better go look for those crab apples. Maybe you could make a pie. I told you, I don't know how to make a pie. I didn't pay attention at home ec class. Maybe you should have. Maybe you should have gone to college. There's a lot of these kids we need to feed. Ah! This life's terrible! I'm running away! Oh, I'm sorry, but the kids are going to follow you. Mommy, where are you going? We need to have a mommy. Ah! My future is so terrifying! <laughs> it's time to bring Molly back to the present time. If she's in the future too long, she might have what's happening now and we can't have that happen it would tear apart time and space mommy you're back whoa uh, that was weird time travel kind of makes me feel like i'm gonna throw up or fart oh mommy daisy my future was as dismal as you thought really tell me all about it i would like to take some notes on this no time, Daisy. I have to change what my future is going to be. Or, or I'm going to be doomed! Molly? Are you vacuuming the floor? Where's my daughter? What have you done with her? You must be an alien that's taken over her body. No, Mom. It's really me. I, I, I just I made a mess with all the Doritos I ate earlier, and I, I wanted to clean them all up. Molly, are you feeling okay, sweetie? 
Yeah, I'm feeling good. Next, I'm gonna do my homework. What? Molly, turn off that vacuum right now and talk to me. Mom, I don't want my future to be as dismal as I thought. I, I saw it. Wait, you saw your future? What are you talking about? Never mind, Mom, but but I, I gotta study because I gotta go to college. I, I, I don't wanna have 7,000 kids in the future and not know how I'm gonna make them French toast. Molly, I'm worried about you. Maybe you should go lay down. Do you have a fever? No, I'm serious. I, I, I wanna be successful in life and be a good mom and, and not marry a race car driver who only cares about buying new tires for his race car, who talks a lot like he's um from Texas. Hey, there's nothing wrong with Texas. We're from Texas. I love Texas. Ah, uh, yeah, you do have a point there. <laughs> anyway, um, I'm glad you're turning over this new leaf, Molly, and um, keep up the good work. But are you sure you're okay? I'm okay, Mom. I just, I just, whoa, is Survivor on? Mitch, is that you? Mitch, you survived! Okay, um, yeah, I don't, I don't care about any of that stuff. Definitely have to watch this. Bring it on, Mitch! Bring it on! But Molly, I thought you were turning over a new leaf. If it means that I miss out on watching Mitch survive this terrible fate, then I guess I'll just have to be a loser in the future. 